planet Earth, our home. It has everything humans need to live, breathe and eat. But we haven't looked after it. For hundreds of years, humans have been taking from the planet, using its resources without thinking about the cost. Now we can see the effects. Changing weather, rising temperatures, storms and fires, melting glaciers, floods, and wildlife at risk of extinction. Experts agree that we and the way we live and work are to blame for making things worse. And the people around the world suffering the most are those who've done the least to cause the damage. There's no planet B! There's no planet B! But it's not too late. Changes can happen. It's a subject many young people care about and an issue where they've raised their voices and demanded to be heard. We will never stop fighting. We will never stop fighting for this planet and for ourselves, our futures, and for the futures of our children and grandchildren. People are relying on politicians and companies to show leadership and demanding they take action. So, to COP26, a huge global meeting about the environment. Leaders of the world's countries will come to Glasgow to talk, make agreements, and show us their plans. What are they going to do about climate change? And will it be enough? It could mean big changes to all our lives. How will we fight back? Cutting emissions? Adapting the way we live? Maybe finding high-tech solutions? Can they agree on a way forward to stop climate change from getting worse? And we'll also have to play our part to protect everyone's future.